I'm in the dashboard now of a site powered by WordPress. And I'm building this site out as a membership offering, and I've chosen S2 Member Pro. Here in the plugins menu, you can see that this installation has been upgraded to S2 Member Pro. I have the original framework that I installed, and now I've added to that S2 Member Pro. So let's take a look at some of the enhancements that are introduced by S2 Member Pro. Here in the S2 Member General Options panel, under Membership Levels and Labels, you'll see that you now have the ability, finally, to define the number of membership levels that you'd like to support. This can go right into your WordPress configuration file. Many site owners like to reduce this down to just one paid level. They might be using custom capabilities. Other site owners might prefer to increase this number to 10 or 15 levels. And you can certainly do that with S2 Member Pro. You'll also find things here like one-time offers upon login. And as one quick example, we'll go with one of these samples down below. Here we're stating that on the customer's very first login, instead of them re being redirected to the, the default login welcome page that you've configured with S2 Member, we might create a special page in WordPress where on the customer's very first login, we welcome them to their account, and we might provide them with some additional details that help them get started on our website. So this can be used in several other ways, and there's examples in this section to show you how this might be used. If you've been using the free version of S2 Member, you've been using PayPal buttons, and you can certainly continue to do that with S2 Member Pro. Down below here, you will see in the PayPal buttons section, under shortcode attributes, S2 Member is making a new shortcode attribute available with the Pro module installed. You can now specify a custom successful return URL. So instead of a customer leaving PayPal checkout and coming back to S2 Member's default auto return page, you can now create a page of your own in WordPress where you provide a message or maybe graphics of your own and you can design it and this becomes very very useful. Many site owners appreciate having this to use with PayPal buttons. Another popular feature that's introduced by S2 Member Pro is located here under Appearance Widgets. You can drag and drop this S2 Member Pro login widget. I already have an instance of it here. And this is easy to configure. There are two states, one when a customer is not logged in, where you might have the title Membership Login. This widget introduces a login box on the front end of your website. And you can do things like configure where the customer might go after logging in. Perhaps you'd like to have them return to the previous page that they had been viewing before they logged in. Then we have a state once they are logged in where we display a profile summary, perhaps with a gravatar image of that customer. So there's several options here that can be configured, and you can even use this through a PHP tag if you prefer. If you're building a custom theme of your own, you might appreciate having this PHP tag. You'll find further documentation on that under S2 Member API Scripting Pro Login Widget. You can also find information about this on our website. Many of these configuration options here can be established through the PHP tag in a more dynamic way. Let's take a look now at Import Export Tools. S2 Member Pro makes it possible for you to export your entire configuration of S2 Member or to import an existing configuration, perhaps from another site. I've seen many site owners establish a default generic configuration of S2 Member, and then they import that into new sites that they set up with S2 Member to help themselves save time. Here you can export your entire user base into a CSV file, which can be opened in applications like Microsoft Excel, or open office. Here you can import an existing user base perhaps from another application that you used prior to S2 Member or you might transfer a user base from one installation of S2 Member to another. There are several details below you will need to format your import file a certain way so that S2 Member Pro can import those users into WordPress for you. Now this tool can also be used to perform mass updates to existing account holders. If you specify a user ID in your import file, rather than importing new members, you can update and make changes to existing customers all at one time. Pro coupon codes work with PayPal Pro Forms, 
and authorize.net forms. Now, of course, under the other gateways section, you can choose which payment gateways you're going to support on your installation. Here I have a very long list because I've enabled all of them. Google Checkout, ClickBank, CC Bill, Authorize.net, Alipay, and of course PayPal Standard Buttons and PayPal Pro Forms. PayPal Pro Forms and Authorize.net Forms are almost identical. It's just a difference between which gateway provider that you choose. So I will start now by taking a look at Pro Forms and demonstrate for you why Pro Forms are the preferred method of integration with S2 Member Pro. Here we can see that it's easy to use free registration forms. Much like the shortcodes that come in the free version of S2 Member for buttons, here we can just take an easy to use shortcode, copy that, and let's go to our list of pages. Now you could put this into a post or a page or even into a text widget if you like, but I'll just put it into this test page. Many of these shortcode attributes can be reconfigured. You'll find documentation for these attributes in your dashboard under the PayPal Pro Forms section. Let's take a quick look. Okay, here you can see I'm running the default, just the plain theme for WordPress, the 2011 theme. So on your site, this will look, I'm sure, look much better because if you've chosen a premium WordPress theme, then you will have a much nicer looking design. But here you can see this looks pretty professional even in just the default theme. This is the form that's introduced by that shortcode. This will support the ability for the customer to register along with any custom registration fields that you've, that you've configured in your installation of S2 Member. Here we have that existing integration with S2 Member's connection to Aweber and MailChimp. So this is a very powerful way to bring registration into the front end of your site instead of using perhaps like in the free version S2 Member integrates with the default login registration system for WordPress. Here we can use the profile summary, the pro login widget, and keep our customers on the front end of our website. All right, let's actually do a, an on-site credit card processing form now with PayPal Pro Forms. And again, this is very much like the integration with Authorize.net. Let's go with level one. We'll go with seven days free. Uh, let's do maybe $129 a month. Well, let's do that yearly. Uh, maybe I'll throw in uh, the custom capabilities music and videos. And I'll generate my pro form. That gives me down below here the WordPress shortcode that I need. I come back to my list of pages and let's test this out. We just paste that right in and let's just do a quick preview. Alright, so here we can see that we now have on-site credit card processing. Now this profile section is already pre-filled because I'm already logged into the site. You can also test this as a new customer by logging out of your website. Down below here, a customer chooses their billing method, enters their credit card information, and completes checkout. So this is very powerful. Upon returning from this form, the customer is ready to log into their account. You can learn all about S2 Member. There's much more to learn at s2member.com. So I'm going to switch tabs here again back to the site. And let's take a quick look at the prices and licensing section at s2member.com. From this page, you'll see that we have two licensing options available. You can purchase a single site license or an unlimited site license. For $69, you get all of the features of S2 Member Pro that we just reviewed in this video. If you have more than one site, then I would encourage you to purchase the unlimited site license. That is the difference between a single site and an unlimited site license, the number of instances of S2 Member that you'll be able to support. You can always purchase a single site license and then upgrade later to the unlimited site. Down below here, you will find that we have a network support license, and this is specifically for multi-site networks who are operating as a blog farm. And you can learn more about our definition of a blog farm from this page. Another great way to demonstrate an S2 Member Pro form is right here at s2member.com. So let's go to the purchase page for the single site license. So here we have a secure checkout form, and this pro form, this is powered by S2 Member Pro, is also configured to accept a coupon code. And I'm going to give you a coupon code right now. Save 10. Save-10 will save you 10% on your purchase of a single site license, or you can also use this coupon for the purchase of an unlimited site license. 
Enter your profile information, the primary domain name for your installation, and choose your billing method. Upon completing checkout, you'll gain access to your account here at s2member.com where you can get the files and the instructions you'll need to install and upgrade your current installation of S2Member. Thank you very much for watching.